First off, we all know I'm a Cody Fern simp. Let's get that fact straight. Also, the fact that there's feral people hiding in the woods, yeah, that actually does exist. The government just doesn't want to tell people if there's feral killer people hiding in the woods because they make money from from the national park. So, yeah, I know this because I've heard a lot of stories and seen a lot of videos enough to know I don't trust the fucking government. Anyways, enough about my fucking anxiety. Let's talk about the episode. I have to say, I thought there was going to be Wendigos for a second or even the Polk family. But nope, this is an entirely new set of feral people. And I have to, I loved this episode. Um, and the twist at the end where Jacob kills his own parents, like, I would too, honestly. Like, I bet poor Jacob thinks they left him in the woods to die. You see, this is why I don't fucking go camping, especially near national fucking forests. And also, they have to thin their numbers. Is How bad is this epidemic of feral people? God damn it. We need more episodes, Ryan, to explain this. Honestly, I saw this tweet that said uh, the show would be a lot better if every episode actually touched on the feral people, or at least, like, a season will touch on the feral people. Like, every episode's, like, a different story about these feral people living in these national parks. I'm, like, I'm all for it. Like, I think the first season's, like, touching on concepts. The first season of American Horror Stories is, like, touching on concepts, what to work with, and I love it. By far, Ball and Feral are two of my favorites. A, because... The OGs, my girl Billy Lord, and my, and my, the person I simp for, Cody Fern. Also, why does all, why are all Cody Fern's characters dying? Michael Langton, Xavier Plimpton, and now Stan Vogel. God damn. Anyways, I loved it. I hope you loved it too. Even like PC people on Twitter hating on Cody Fern, and I'm like, why? Why? I'd simp for the fucker. Why would you hate on such a beautiful man? Anyways, this is Liz Martin signing out. Goodbye.